In this sum, square prism is resting on one of its corner on HP. See this. It is resting on one of its corner and X is inclined 30 degree to HP. So what we will do? Since X is inclined to HP, first we will draw axis perpendicular to HP and we will draw it in a such a fashion that corner will come on right hand side because it is inclined on it is resting on one of its corner. So when we draw, we will draw square prism where it is resting on one of its corner, right? So first we will draw 45, 45. First we will draw square, then we will draw front view. This is A, B, C, D, A dash, B dash, B dash, C dash, and the whole point is P, Q, R, S, P dash, Q dash, S dash, R dash. And we have axis also that is O dash, M dash. So this is axis O M. Now there is an axis inclined 30 degree to HP. So if you see the main diagram, if axis inclined 30 degree, base will be inclined at what angle? 60. Because this is 90. If axis inclined at 30, this is 90. So this will be inclined at 60 degree. So what we will do? We will draw 60 degree from here. Take this distance, P dash, R dash. Cut on this side. Take this height. Cut on this. And take this distance, cut on this side. So this is A dash, B dash, D dash, C dash, this is O dash, and this is P dash, Q dash, S dash, R dash. Now we will project A dash from here and A from here. So we get A, B dash from here, and B from here. So we get C dash from here and C from here. Same way, D dash from here and D from here. So we get D. Then you project P dash from here, so we get P. Q dash from here, so we get Q. See this Q is from here, P is from here. R dash from here, R from here. S dash from here, S from here. Right? Now when you see from the top, see the main diagram, when you see the main diagram, when you see from the top, this upper upper points, A, B, C, D, you can see those points clearly, why? Because the, those are nearer to you. And you can see extreme boundary. So what we will do first? First we will draw extreme boundary. And this A, B, C, D will be down. Right? Because when observer will see from top, he can see A, B, C, D very clearly. So A, B, C, D will be down. And he won't be able to see R dash. Why? Right? Because it is away from the observer. So line passing through R dash would be dotted. So R to S, R to Q would be dotted. Now, when you see from the top, A dash, B dash is nearer to you. So A, B will be down. And C dash, R dash is away from you. So that would be dotted. You can show this angle which is 30 degree, this is 90, this is 60, base is 30, and height. height is 60. 